The good old Midnight Coup finally back. Is it actually any good for PvP or PvE? I can't really speak for PvE, but it, I think it looks pretty good. As for PvP, it's not going to be better than Luna's Howl by any means, but it's not the worst hand cannon ever with stuff like Zen Moments or even Explosive Payload if that's what you want to run. I'm going to be honest with you guys, I don't want Explosive Payload ever since the changes. It's not my most desired perk because I am doing less damage now with Explosive Payload. You can still three top people, but you do have less range technically. So instead of Explosive Payload, personally I'd go for either Enlightened Action or Moving Target. The problem with Moving Target, it has 90 aim assists, so you're only using Moving Target for the movement speed. So the best option here, unironically, is probably Enlightened Action, but but you should probably just go for explosive payload if you don't mind the less damage. After that, we would do accurized rounds and either small bore or hammer forge. I think small bore makes most sense here. Even though I have Zen moments, it's always nice to have a little bit extra stability. Surprisingly, I'm not going with fluted barrel. It already has so much handling off the bat with a 60. You don't really need any more, but if you wanted to, you could just use fluted. As you guys can see, yeah, the stats aren't anything crazy. And honestly, it's just one of those guns you're going to use to reminisce about the past and probably put away for a little while while unless you're playing pve i think this is mainly going to be a popular pve weapon and we just so happen to have almost the god roll or the roll that i wanted we don't have a ranged masterwork but we've got stability i'll take it any day of the week this gun feels a lot better than it used to a hundred percent this makes a big difference and they also updated the stats so it's not absolute garbage let's get into the gameplay before we go any further i want to let you guys know that i teamed up with apex for an awesome line of pcs so if you've been looking to upgrade or just go into pc gaming as a whole I would highly suggest checking them out. We have a cheap option, a middle option, and of course the most expensive option. And you can customize any piece or bit you want that you don't like if you want to go a little bit higher or lower depending on how much money you have. Now keep in mind, these are pre-built gaming PCs. If you're on a budget, this is not going to be your option because you're going to be paying a little bit extra for the convenience and for them building it as a whole. But if you have extra money to spend and you don't mind paying the labor costs and you want to have it built by a professional and make sure that it's right and have some warranty on it then this is definitely your best bet because they can build it no problem satisfaction guaranteed and again since price could be a problem for a lot of you guys you can finance the computer so you don't have to pay it all up front because computers are not cheap so i'm very happy they have this option if you're interested in buying a computer you guys can use my code walla at checkout for up to 250 dollars off of your first gaming computer thank you again to apex gaming pcs let's get back to it i don't expect many people to be I can't finish the sentence, bro. What a terrible start. Okay. I don't expect a lot of people to be using this in PvP. Mainly because it was originally a PvE weapon. And I think the rolls are... I think they're good for PvE. As of recording this, I'm not 100% sure. There will be people that do use it in PvP, though. Don't get me wrong. Because, I mean, it's the Midnight Coup, bro. It's the OG. Zen Moment, I feel like, helped me out there pretty good. At least for that one shot. Yeah, he only shot me one time, but... The flinch was uh, very manageable. Almost lost that gunfight. My shots were absolutely terrible. We have a pretty good start so far, though. Uh, statistically, you know, this gun, not so great. I think we talked about it in the intro, or I should be talking about it in the intro, telling you guys why I don't like explosive payload. You could definitely go for it still, though. I just hate the fact that I'm doing less damage. It would tilt me really, really hard. And since I'm already used to the damage on other 140s now, after they uh, changed it once again, I don't want to be doing less damage. It's going to piss me off. So screw that. I don't know. Uh, moving target's probably the best choice. Unless you want to go for something else, that column is completely up to you. Who am I going to go for? No tag. I'm so pissed. Okay, that guy saved me. Hopefully he doesn't kill me now. I have some shoddy ammo. Someone's behind me. Okay, I got to... What do I want to do here? This guy's not inside tube, is he? He is. Okay, I'm gonna swipe at him, shotty. Thank you. That guy, I'm pretty sure that guy's a terrible shotgun, so I don't have to be too worried about him. Okay, very nice nade. Ah, I didn't want to waste any ammo on him, man, but he hit a weird dodge. I thought he was gonna hit me with a backwards dodge, but he was just using invis, so it threw me off quite a bit. Some guy's top or bottom right? Top. He, he'll probably re-challenge. He's too tapped to look for the other guy. Thank you. Behind me now. Uh, I don't want to ego challenge just yet. Maybe he throws a grenade. I'm going to get ready with a sword. Slice through the shield. No problem. That's kind of risky, by the way, if you intend on slicing through the shield because Destiny 2 and sometimes it won't give you the damage. Nice shots on... Oh. 
please don't kill me. I gotta go. Is he gonna come back and chase me? Oh yeah, he is. There we go. Up left. Explosive payload. Still annoying, by the way. That's why I'm saying you can definitely still use it. But I feel like if I wasn't terrible, I definitely could have just killed him right there. Like, no problem. He has heavy ammo. He has an LMG, though, this Titan. I'm going to throw this ball. If no tag, I'm not chasing. If no tag, I'm just backing up. This guy's just running in a straight line. I got to say, man, it has to be Zen moment, but this thing definitely feels a fuck ton better uh, now that it's new and back again, obviously. All right, there we go. That, that was a pretty clean game. No one cracked in this lobby besides JP, of course. That was a good game. I like that. And it's nice I'm playing on my account, too. When new weapons come out, typically I'll use someone else's role, but, you know, this role's not too bad. E. Pigeon. Wait, he's using Igneous and Last Word? What is this combo? Insane combo. Okay, my... Is he gonna chase? Full chase? I have no shoddy to be playing this range anyways. We can just back up, play the shield. He's trolling. That nade actually might tag me. Now we're good. I'm gonna grapple here and then go for like the double grapple, if you will. No! Okay, since there's only like four people, no one spawned there, which kind of sucks. But if there were more people, I think that would have been pretty cool. And some guy's also using uh, fighting line as well. I'm gonna grab heavy ammo. I'm not going to get too many kills with it, I promise. We're going to crouch here and wait. I opened the door in accident, which is kind of a dumb move. Free tap, easy. And I'm going to see if I can get another free kill here. Oh my god. I was going to bust my sword out because I thought he had a, a worm hush for a second. Grapple towards the next free kill here. Slice away. Okay, this guy's using last word behind me. We are. I have to, boys. I have to. I'm sorry. This guy has last word. I don't fuck with that. We're gonna jump over, grapple. Easy kill again. I didn't make a ball because my tangle uh, cooldown is not over yet. Right side close. He doesn't have heavy because I have it. We should be good. And break the shield. I don't know if he's gonna fall for it. <laughs> okay, I sorted him. <laughs> he's gonna get mad about that one. <laughs> Wait, he does have worm husk. I'm grappling in. All right, I'm back flipping after that. That was nice, I would say. Pretty decent movement. Not too bad. Bro! You know what? I I, I deserve the whiff. I'm, I've been using too much heavy. Crutching too much heavy ammo. Is this guy AFK? He was definitely playing the game. He was definitely playing the game. Where's this a, uh, last word guy? He took my kill. Fuck. I'm gonna slice it. Oh. He also has a rocket on now. I gotta be careful. I'm gonna bait the rocket. He didn't fall for it. Behind me. And he has Igneous Hammer full health. I don't know if he's going to push or not. Honestly, he probably... Sh okay, now he definitely pushes because that was stupid of me, right? Doesn't push? All right, I'm sliding this. I get this easy three tap here. It's kind of weird that I'm getting handling like mid gunfight and also the anti-flinch. Like it works together really good. I didn't think about it that much up until I started playing. But it actually does work pretty well together behind me. I'm going to grapple. Here we go. I didn't do exactly what I wanted to, but since he just shoulder charged in, it worked out in my favor. I'm going to go grapple this guy too. A lot of grapple kills today. I am so sorry. I think you guys like to see that though. I'm going to come backflip on this guy, I think. And uh, clean up with a shoddy. I don't have a ball because the tangle cooldown. All right, I'm going to just actually full send this. And Drang? Oh, hell no. Yeah, I'm fighting a Drang and a Last Word this game. How am I going to win this? Who knows? This is going to jump up. If he goes inside, I'm good. He's not going inside. I might actually be screwed here. Maybe I pop my super. In a uh, Midnight Coup video, I pop my super. Thoughts? Bad idea? I think it's a good idea. I think it's a great idea. I think it's a great idea. I'll take that. Thank you. And I'm going to get Mr. JP Blink again. Yo! Wait, the door didn't open. He's coming back. Is he not? I don't want to get. I, I don't want to get a kill with my super. That'd be kind of lame. I already got one. I don't want to get multiple. I don't know if he's gonna challenge. Nope, he's running from me. Smart man. Smart man. I'm gonna go towards the left and see if I can get a kill on bridge. Oh, he ran out of ammo. I'm pretty sure he did. Maybe, maybe not. Right or left? Right side. That's not the guy with the igneous hammer, so I can challenge at a distance and not not be worried. He has shoddy though. 
Wait, he has a slug, not a shotgun. Alright. Oh! Good game! That was pretty good, but it's, it was kind of lame. There's only four people, but I think, I think those games were pretty solid. You guys get the idea. The Midnight Coup's back.